Hey, what's up guys? MGH here and welcome back to my Portsmouth Road to Glory. Although we are sticking with England in the Euros today, it's part two and we're up against Netherlands. They are in second place in the table, as you can see here. We've beaten Denmark, we've beaten Northern Ireland, and now it's time to beat the Dutch as well. Okay, so here we go, guys. This is to progress into the knockout stages of the Euros. We've got a slightly different team up today, a few different players that we haven't used yet. Let's take a look at the lineups. So I'm sticking with the 4-2-3-1 formation. It seems to work really well so far. We've scored a lot of goals, but as you can see, we've got a Fobe up front. We've got McNerney, we've got Delph. We've even got Kulka and Baines coming in for this game as well. Now let's take a look at the Netherlands. They've got some very, very nice players in there. Very good going forward. And actually their defense looks very strong as well. Blind playing in the heart of midfield. De Vrij and Van Dijk in, mid, uh, in defense. Willems at left back, a very nice left back. Really like this guy. It's going to be a close match. I've got a feeling this will be the hardest one so far, but I reckon we can do some serious damage if we uh, if we can get the ball up to a Fobe. I mean, pace, strength, he's got 90 finishing. It's just going to be easy to score goals with him, I think. And of course, we have the mighty McNerney down the left. He's going through here. Ball in. Oh, go on. No freaking way. No. Three minutes in and a Fobe. I was just talking about him has scored a header. That is ridiculous. Look at this from McNerney. Who who needs Sterling? 88 rated Sterling? Who needs him? We've got freaking McNerney down that left side. Good header from Afobe away from the keeper and we've made a fantastic start to this game guys. We can go through on a draw so I don't have to win but obviously I would love to put a few past Netherlands. Here goes Walker. Prefer him over to Klein. I'm gonna hit that. Oh my god, it almost went to Barkley at the far post. But yeah, I saw some comments, people saying I should really be using Klein. But I prefer Walker because he is a little bit more physical, you know. He's a bit stronger on the ball. I'm actually going to pass this and shoot. Come on, Barkley. Just smack it. Oh my god, oh my... Oh, oh my god, I thought that was going in. Can you imagine? The scenes! Here come the Netherlands, they look dangerous. He's gone through Corker too easily there. Here goes Wijnaldum, captain. Oh no, no. Oh, it's hit the post. We got away with that one. We are still yet to concede in this tournament. So, uh, yeah, I want another clean sheet if possible. We're in now on the counter-attack. Hang on. Here goes Barkley. Through for Ali. Oh, my God, we're through. Surely we're going to finish this. Come on, Ali. Oh, my God, I've hit the post. Here we go on another counter-attack. Over here to McNerney. He's got the pace, surely. Yeah, look at him go. You can't stop him. Get across in now. Along the ground. Virgil van Dijk's almost put it into his own net just before half-time there. Hang on, there might still be time for one more attack. No, there we go. That's the end of the first half. So, guys, we're winning the game, but Netherlands do look pretty good. Oh, no, Vine Adams got through. No, keep the clean sheet. Yes, Joe Hart. Good save, son. I'm going to use my height with Joe Hart here. Oh, never mind. They've played it quite far backwards. Oh, my God, it's just over the bar. Here they come again. That's a good cross. Oh, no, I've taken him out. Oh, that could have been a penalty. Just over 10 minutes to go, guys. I could be in trouble here. Baines isn't very quick. No, get it out, Stones. Yes, well defended. Keep it out. Come on. Oh, no. No, no, no. Get it out, Stones, this time. That's more like it. Right, let's get on the break here. Up to a Fobe. Nope. I've lost out to Blind. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, it's, it's gone wide. Thank God for that. Here they come again, though. No, they've gone through. No, my clean sheet. No, it's the first goal I've conceded in the tournament. But guys, I can't complain. Frickin' hell, Netherlands have been all over me in this second half. It was coming. It's a lovely assist from Depay, but Stone's just out of position there. It's my bad. It's some bad defending, that's for sure. Five minutes to go. I can't lose this now. I need to get a point at least. Deli Ali on the ball now. Over here to McNerney. He's done well today. Let's see if he can continue this run. He's still going. Oh man, that is so unlucky, but Barkley's got it back. Hit it. Good save by the keeper. If only it fell to a Fobe, he could have just nodded that one in. There we have it, guys. We are through in the Euros. We've won the group. We only needed a draw, and we got it. But Netherlands, wow, they, they really, really were a tough opponent. So just before we get into the next game, we've actually got to end the season. So I'm going to show you the emails we've just got from the Portsmouth board. They said, amazing season. We exceeded what was expected of us. The Euro League performance was not as we hoped. Well, yeah, okay, fair enough. And uh, pass on our congratulations to the players. It was, a, it was great fun to be involved in the domestic cup. So there you go. We haven't been fired. And let's get into the next season and continue with the Euros. Right, so guys, we're into the next season. We've got my objective set by the board here. In the domestic cup, they want me to reach the round of 16. That's fair enough. Here is the budget. A massive £32 million and 150000 per week. Don't forget, we are in the Champions League this season. So... 
yeah, having extra money is definitely going to help. The league objective is to qualify for the Champions Cup. So top four, I'm pretty sure because we won it last year, we can win it again. And of course, guys, now it's time to pick the uh, the pre-season tournament in 2020. I'm actually going to go for the big one. Here we go. We're going to Germany, guys. A few more things to go through. Of course, we do have a player coming on his pre-contract, and that is Jonathan Tarr, our centre-back. Absolutely can't wait to use him. He's going to be amazing. We've had three players go back, so we obviously lost Adelaide, we've lost Yarmus, and we have lost Ferreira. And here's our Champions Cup objective. They want me to reach the quarterfinals. What? Are you mad? That's, this is the first season in the competition, and you want me to get to the quarters. Wow. But now, guys, it's time to get into the next round of the Euros, and it's a big one. It's the quarterfinals, and we're up against one of our arch rivals, Germany. Oh god, this is going to be a tough game. We've got to win this. I can't go out to Germany. So it's Germany to kick off the game. They've got an extremely strong squad. I accidentally skipped the uh, the you know the lineup thing, so apologies for that. But I I know already they're going to have one of the best squads in the tournament. So this is probably going to be the hardest game we have. So if we can get through Germany, I'll be confident that I can beat anyone in the next round. Let's get that through to Rooney. He's playing at Cam today. Over here to Theo Walcott. I see Sterling making a run. Oh, hang on. He's gone into Kane. Oh, my God. Neuer spilled it. Yes. No, he's offside. No, Sterling. So unlucky. He was just offside there. What a start to the game, though, guys. Absolutely fantastic. Flying already. He goes Niles over here to Klein. Get the ball in. Kane's there. No way. Neuer's freaking... Oh, my God. Guys, we should be 2-0 up. Let's go again. Oh, hang on. Look at the space for Theo. Hit it near post. Straight at Neuer. Why not? Yeah, why not? Come on, Jack. Find a good pass. That's not bad. Here goes Rooney. We're going to cut inside with a fake shot, I think. Through ball for Kane. Yes, he's got there. Come on, you've got to finish this. Yes, with his left foot. Why did he go with his left? I tried to finesse it with his right. But, guys, it doesn't matter. We're beating Germany. Get in there. Come on, lads. This is brilliant. Lovely bit of play from Rooney. I didn't think the pass would work, but Boateng got nutmegged. Neuer got beat, and they are losing this game. Come on, Harry Kane. Well done. Three goals already in the championship. Oh, no. Muller's got inside too easily there. No. Bender now. We need to get the ball. We need to get the ball. No, 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 no. Mesut Ozil. He's offside. He's offside. We're even now. We're even now. You, you don't deserve it, Germany. We've been absolutely destroying you. I feel kind of bad because, obviously, it's Mesut Ozil. Actually, hang on. No, it wasn't even Mesut that was offside. It was Muller. Oh, dearie me. Oh, well. What a shame. Ball over the top. Yes, come on, Theo. Come on, Theo. Come on. Pull it back now. And again on the outside. Now get the cross in. Go on. Oh, okay, yeah, I wasted that chance. Wasn't really well played by me. But, guys, we're into half time. 1-0 up. Oh, no, I've made a mistake. Volland's going to get through here. Come on, Stones. Block him off. That's it. Well played. Goetze on the ball now. He's lost out. Oh, dear, Goetze. Oh, dear. And now we're going to make it 2-0. Come on, Kane. Come on, just keep running. I know it's Boateng, but you can do this. Pass inside. And again. Oh, oh, come on, please. Please, Rooney. No, he's at the post. No, 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 no. No, no, I've just completely wasted it, guys. What am I doing? And now it's Germany coming at me again. No, Boateng's through. No, no. Yes, Joe Hart. I freaking love you, Hart. Thank you so much. Just don't concede now. Please don't concede now. Please, 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 please get it out. Get out, get out, get out. No, no. Oh, oh my God, you... No, 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 that didn't just happen. What is this shit? No. Oh, man, that is so frustrating. Pretty much the last attack and the last shot of the game. And now we're going into extra time. Luckily for me, I've still got all three substitutions available. And I knew I would save them for this exact reason. So Barkley's going to come on a slightly deeper role there. Morrison's going to come on for Walcott. I know it sounds a bit weird, but he's going to play out on the right. And I think I'm going to leave it for now. Maybe Kulka in the last few minutes of the game up front. Nah, I'm kidding. I'm not Klopp. Are Germany still playing on all-out attack? Look, Boateng's up front again. What is going on? Are they mad? If I can win the ball and get on the counter, though, that means they're in trouble. Like here. Come on, Rooney. Yes, come on. They're in trouble here, guys. They are in trouble. Up to Ravel. Come on, son. On the inside, maybe. No, that was the wrong decision. I should have stayed on the outside. And that's that for the first half of extra time. Let's get into the second half. Oh, that could be nice. Oh, that could be nice. Here's Kane over here to Sterling. Little fake shot, maybe. Oh, it's worked. Put it back in. Please finish this, Kane. Come on. Yes, we've freaking done it, guys. We have done it. Germany. Oh, there's surely not enough time. Please say this is over now. 
I do not want to play or go to penalties. I don't want to go to penalties, but I don't even want to play anymore. I wish it was golden goal. Kane has scored a massive goal there. A double in this game. Oh, right. Defend. Defend, defend, defend. They've been caught out here, guys. We could punish them for it. Up here to Kane again. Come on, Kane. Oh, it's Rooney. Rooney, go on, son. Oh, my God. Rooney. Who needs Kane when you've got the 36-year-old Rooney? Oh, my God. Germany are losing this game 3-1 now. They're still on all-out attack. And look at the space we had. I was sure that was Kane. If only it was, it would have been a hat-trick. But Rooney gets his goal. And there you go, guys. We are going through to the semi-finals of this Euros Championship. Blow the whistle, ref. Come on. Yes. <laughs> yes, we've done it. Guys, we can go on and win this tournament. If we can beat Germany, we can beat anyone. I'm pretty sure they have one of the strongest squads in this game, especially in 2020 after all the growth that those players get. Yeah, I'm, I'm sure we can beat anyone that we come up against in the future of this tournament. And that, guys, is the end of this episode. Here you can see the other teams still in the competition. We don't know who we're going to get it could be Belgium, Switzerland, Portugal, Netherlands, France or Poland. Some very strong teams left in this competition. So uh, it's going to be interesting to see who we get in the semi-finals. But out of all of those teams, I would have least wanted Germany in the quarterfinals. And we've beat them. So there you go, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Please do leave a like rating if you have enjoyed it. Make sure you subscribe if you're new around here. And check out shop.officialmgh.com to get yourself some MGH gear. And I will see you in the next episode very soon.